In this problem, we're looking at cells of tickets, and we're told that during her first sh during her shift at the museum ticket booth, Leah sold 115 tickets for a total of $1,163. We're told that adult tickets cost $12 and student tickets cost $5. And we're asked how many of each type of ticket, adults and student tickets, did Leah sell? So let's define since they since they told us that the number of total tickets is 115 we need to define one of the types of tickets as a variable and the other one based off that 115 so let's go ahead and call we'll call adult tickets the number of adult tickets a we'll call the number of student tickets then 115 minus the number of adult tickets which is a the cost of each adult ticket is twelve dollars the cost of each student ticket is five dollars so the total value in dollars 12 times A for adult tickets, 12 times the number of adult tickets, and 5 times the number of student tickets, which is 115 minus the number of adult tickets. And we know that total is $1,163. So now we can set up our equation. We have 12A plus, 100, or plus 5 times 115 minus A and we know that total is 1163 so we distribute the 5 12 a plus 5 times 115 is 575 minus 5 times a is 5a combine like terms 12 minus 5 is 7a plus 575 equals 1163 subtract 575 from both sides and 7a equals 588 we divide both sides by 7 and we get a the number of adult tickets is 84 so the number of student tickets is 115 minus 84 which equals 31 student tickets so Leah sold 84 adult tickets and she sold 31 student tickets. So to check this, we're going to substitute the amounts times the numbers. So 12 times 84, $12 a ticket times 84 adult tickets, plus 31 times 5, 31 student tickets times $5 each. Does that equal 1,163? So 12 times 84 is 1,008. And 31 times 5 is 155. And 1,008 plus 155 does equal 1,163. So our solution checks. And we know that Leah sold 84 adult tickets and 31 student tickets.